Yeah, hi Topper, and we're just off of MacArthur. Basically, this water came in so hard, so fast. What you're gonna see behind me here is the five foot in diameter metal corrugated storm drain, and it just collapsed. So here's what that looked like. If this is the storm drain, and the road is on top of it, basically all the rushing water coming through there just crumbled that, and then the road on top of it had no choice but to buckle underneath it. Come back over here and let me show you the damage that it did. The water here, this edge is absolutely crumbled. That storm drain just came completely apart. 75 homes are completely cut off right now from people being able to get in and out of this neighborhood. Highway Services is handling that right now, but let's check in right now with Melissa Nord, who was out here a little bit earlier talking to stunned residents when they saw that they couldn't get in or out. This evening, Rockwood Creek flowing much calmer right now, but this morning in the midst of receiving three inches of rain in one hour and even more than that, there was a flash flood. And normally where Belfast Road is right up there, there's a pipe that goes underneath the roadway that carries that water from the creek all the way in this direction. But the water was going so fast and debris clogged up the drain that it gave way. The road washed out and you can see there is a slew of debris all the way down the creek. Metal just torn, wrapped around that tree and now residents have no way of getting to the other side. Less than five miles away from this washed out road, Fenway Road in Bethesda is also no more. Too much water in too little time sent Cabin John Creek rushing over the roadway like whitewater rapids. A small water main that was under the road collapsed under the weight of the flash flood. This is right near the site of the 2008 River Road water main break in flood. At this point today, it's been neighbors helping neighbors trying to figure out how those 75 residents on the other side of the washed out road can get home to their family, to their pets and to their loved ones. In the meantime, this is a county road, so Montgomery County will be assessing the damage and figuring out how long it's going to take to repair. In Potomac, meteorologist Melissa Nord, WUSA 9.